Is This a Great State or What? is sponsored by We Oki. We got you, Oklahoma. Well, you know, closing the books at the end of the year usually means you're about to open a new book to start your business for the next year. But Galen Culver found a small business in Ardmore that's closing for good this week. Its owners are retiring after nearly 55 years. Well, I'll get an apron on here. And of all the ways to measure time and distance, pardon the mess, people like Harold Cottle can see it in the souls of their customers and the hold on a storm welt. Shoe care, horse tack, used boots and saddles. He's been at these machines a long time, his whole adult life. Let me borrow my crutch back here. Mm. A bad leg meant Harold had to work without doing much walking. My ankle's still stiff. So he took to repairing the wear put on his customer's shoes. They thought if I could tool leather, well, I could patch this or that, bridle or whatever, and, and that, so I did. <laughs> We have the best customers in the world. His wife Ann helped out a lot too, working in this shop and another one in Sulphur, putting in 50 years of her own. After uh, 54 years, we got a lot of stuff in here. The old Circle C boot and saddle repair shop extended the life of thousands of boots over the years. All the work guaranteed, never just cobbled together. We need to make you a master shoe repairman, not a cobbler. Their life's work is still scattered over this tiny shop on North Washington and Ardmore. Repaired boots wait for pickup, others are for sale, saddles are marked off. Harold and Ann are spending the last few days of 2021 trying to get rid of as much as they can before they close up for good. You still look pretty busy. Oh yes, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how many people just yesterday said you can't quit, you know. And they are a true mom and pop shop. Their expertise won hard over long miles and patient work. The Coddles are finally calling it quits, satisfied. They lasted longer than a lot of other pairs. I probably won't set alarm in the mornings and because uh, she don't like them either. <laughs> in Ardmore, Galen Culver, News 4. Is this a great state or what? The freedom of no alarm clocks and the old Circle C boot and saddle repair shop will only be open for the rest of this week with shorter hours. Harold says he'll still do some leather work with his son when he feels like it and from the comfort of his own workshop at home.